customize your goddamn audience, please. Hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here so I thought I'd do a video on Instagram paid promotions because I keep seeing them like advertised and I'm like what does the promote button do is it a good way to get more followers and more engagement so I thought I'd save you guys the money and just do a review first so then you can make your own decision on if you do want to go ahead with promoting your post through Instagram paid promotions so if you do like the sound of the video and you do enjoy it please do not forget to like comment and subscribe it helps me out so much and click the bell so you're notified every single time I post and let's get straight into the video just as a disclaimer, obviously the effects that I had from this might not be the same that you experience. It depends completely on your content, your reach, who's interested. But I think it's good to know the effects for other people's accounts regardless. I just want to show you guys what post I decided to promote and also what my starting followers and likes were for this post. So as you can see, this is the one that I chose. Love it, not gonna lie. Um, and obviously if you look at my actual Instagram account, it's very similar in what I post. So I would assume that if you liked that post, you'd probably like the rest of my account and follow. So yeah, this is the post I promoted and this was my starting followers and my starting likes just as a good comparison to when it has actually finished the promotion. But first you have to have the right account to be able to promote. So I had a blogger account because you can actually set what type of account you have on Instagram. I don't get this option with my personal account but I could also do it with a business account. So if you are looking to promote, make sure that you do have your account set to one of these. And I'm pretty sure that if you've already set it to personal or whatever, you can literally switch within seconds so it's fine. So you just click the promote button and then you can decide where you want to send the people. So you can send them to a website. So I just considered a link in my YouTube. But then I thought it'd be quite hard to kind of measure exactly how many people subscribe from that or if it would work I've heard that it doesn't work very well so I thought let's just stick with Instagram so you just send them to your profile and then you get the option to select whether you want your audience to be automatic so just anyone really or you can customize it to like an age range a gender a country I stuck with automatic which is a big mistake that I made because I kind of assumed that if I customized it I'd be reducing my reach but I don't think that would necessarily be the case because you still are only charged for your reach so if I did reach less people by customizing it they'd only charge me based on my reach this is a really good thing about Instagram promotions if you don't reach as many people as predicted they will only charge you for the percentage that you did reach. So as you can see here, it tells you your estimated reach depending on how much you wanna spend and over how many days. So I set mine for 12 pounds over six days because I thought two pound a day, if it doesn't work, it's not the end of the world, it's only 12 pounds. Obviously here you can see the estimated reach, but if I wouldn't have reached that minimum, they would not have charged me the full 12 pounds within the six days, which is really good because then you're not wasting your money. You just put in your payment details. I felt very secure doing this, it was fine. Just put my card details in and then it processed and then it went to pending, which I believe it only took like, I think it was less than an hour for it to approve my um, promotion. I just, I just probably have to double check that your payment went through and things like that. So the first thing that I noticed from this was that I was getting likes, like for sure. But a lot of these likes were from middle-aged slash older men. Um, which made me feel a bit weird that they were seeing my profile but then I was like well I've set it to automatic so I didn't really restrict who could see it. I also did get a few weird comments from a man as well that I wouldn't normally get so that was kind of unwanted attention but the thing that I love about this is the analytics so it actually breaks down the percentage of people that have come to your profile through the promotion so you'll know how effective it was. So as you can see from mine, 83% of people that visited my profile came via the promotion, which is amazing. I've always struggled to get followers on this account, but I think it's probably because I don't actually follow that many people as well that are similar to me. But in terms of my likes, compared to all the other posts, my likes were like very high. They were above 200, I think. And all my other posts don't reach even like 70. So definitely works likewise. And I think if I would have customized my audience as well that would have got me a lot more followers but I did actually only gain a few followers from this as you can see here it was predominantly males that viewed my profile through the promotion so I think if I would have customized it I definitely would have had more followers because I probably would have customized it to females not being sexist or anything but I know that a lot more younger females are interested in fashion and I think if I would have set it to more like teenagers that would have been really good as well but my age range wasn't that bad like I'm happy with that but I think the gender was maybe a bit of an issue and as you can see just to compare from the first predicted reach I was in like the lower section of the estimated reach but I was still in it so I was still charged the full 12 pounds over the six days um, which is fine but obviously it would have been nice if I'd reached more people because the estimated reach was literally like 4,000s worth of scope and I was in the lower category but I still think it's wicked that you can pay such a minimal amount to reach so many more people than you normally would 
Something I found really weird is that seven people saved my post and I'm like, why are you saving it? I find that really odd because I don't think anyone's ever saved my post. Maybe they have because I haven't checked, but it, it can feel a bit weird and out of your comfort zone when you've got random people, like older men liking your pictures and potentially saving them. It can feel a bit weird. So yeah, so the main thing from this is customize your goddamn audience, please. But if you guys do enjoy this video and would like to see me do a customized version and maybe we invest more into it, I would be happy to do so. I'd be happy to invest like, like 30 or 40 pounds next time. If you want me to do it for YouTube, so linking my website and seeing how many new subscribers I get from that because I think that would be quite interesting but I'm not sure how well that would work. Yeah, I really hope that was helpful for you guys and kind of gave you an insight as to how Instagram paid promotions do work because I've been so intrigued. So I'm kind of glad that I've tried it out for myself on like a smaller scale. I'm not sure I'd do it again. Um, maybe if I was a bit bigger, I'd do it again, but I'm not actually someone that really cares about my Instagram followers. I'm all about building my YouTube subscribers because that's the platform that I enjoy the most. But if you are someone that's trying to get bigger on Instagram and maybe get brands to notice you, I do think that it is quite a good way to do so if you customise your audience and maybe invest a little bit more money into it because I do think you'll see the results. And as I said, you'll only be charged for your reach, which is wicked, so yeah. Like I said at the start, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and click the bell if you haven't done already and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.